While the weather was not ideal for the 2012 ACC men's tennis finals, the style of tennis played by Virginia was nothing short of ideal. Storms forced the final day of championship competition to be played at the indoor facility on the campus of University of North Carolina. The Virginia Cavaliers have dominated the ACC tennis landscape over the last nine years in both the regular season and championships. They entered the finals hoping to secure their 92nd consecutive victory against ACC competition. And for the third straight season, the Who's opponent was Duke. The Blue Devils came in ranked eighth in the nation, but unfortunately for them, Virginia was ranked number two. The Cavaliers started the match by clinching the doubles point as Jameer Jenkins and Drew Courtney outlasted Dukes Enrique Kuna and Chris Mengel 8-6 on the number one court. As singles play began, Virginia got off to a fast start when sophomore Alex Damajan took a 6-2, 6-2 victory over Chris Mengel on the number two court. Championship MVP Drew Courtney continued his outstanding play during the championship, posting a 7-6, 6-3 decision over Fred Saba on the number four court. On the number six court, Duke snapped the Cavaliers' string of five straight shutouts in ACC championship play when Jason Tahir took a 6-3, 6-4 win over UVA's Julian Uruguin. However, the match was clinched in a battle of top 10 nationally ranked players on the number one court as Jameer Jenkins defeated Enrique Kuna 6-3, 7-6. It feels unbelievable just to tribute to uh, the hard work that we put in um, over the off season and actually during the regular season maintaining. Um, tribute to the, the great leaders that we have, Drew Courtney and Phil and guys like Dino who sit on the sideline and give us the support from the back. So it just, it just feels really good, um, the team coming together and getting this done together. With a 4-1 to score, Virginia clinched their sixth straight ACC title and eighth in nine years. Head coach Brian Bolin said he knew that his squad would need to be at their best against a strong Duke team. Hats off to Duke, what a great team and, and they competed so hard and they deserve a lot of credit for the tournament they had. And You know, the ACC is one of the best conferences in the country and there's so many competitive teams and we have so much respect for it. So to have another undefeated season is a great tribute to the players on the team and I'm so proud for them.